All right. Hello, everybody. My name is uh, Kevin. Um, I know that a lot of you have uh, received a cobalt 40 volt with this charger. And then guess what you did? You put it into the weed eater and guess what? It did not do anything. Then you said, oh, it needs to be recharged. So you grab this and you put it onto the recharger. And when you did, none of the lights were on. Regardless, there was no lights. Say hello, Peanut. Hello. All right. So, and then you're like, crap, the battery or the charger must be bad. But guess what? Neither. Neither one are bad. So, what, you, what needs to happen is that this battery has gotten so dead that the charger does not even recognize it is a battery. So, you need to put a small amount of charge on to the battery in order for it, for the battery charger to recognize it. So, if you have these certain things at your home, I'm telling you, this will happen within one minute, maybe two minutes, then all of a sudden, ta-da, your battery will start charging onto your battery charger. So first of all, what you need to have are these cables. I'll lay these down here. You have your negative and you have your positive. I got these from my, my commercial electric right here and it's still good even after I, I utilize these. So what you want to have, your negative and your positive, your positive, and the other end of the positive. So, how is this going to help me out? So, what else you need, if you do have it, is an actual charger. And that's what I have here. Now, this one actually is an electric one. Uh, this one right here, I used to keep from my Mustang uh, to keep it charged in the winter time, uh, plug in the wall, but some people actually have uh, a chargeable one, they keep it in the car in case their battery dies, and that could be used as well. But this is what I use. So I came out and I was like, crap, this SOB is dead. Plug it in here, I get no lights, no nothing. Okay, what to do next? So what I did, you'll notice you have positive, and you have negative. What I did was, I input this into the positive. Sorry, I'm using this with one hand, hold on. Positive. Hold on. And then, negative. So for these, what I did, I actually got a knife and slit the side of it so I can get to the terminals right there. So, so what you want to do is once you slit both the positive and the negative, you want to get your terminals here positive, negative, and I'm not going to connect it up because mine's already worked. Basically, you want to slide back the terminals, slide back the, the rubber in order to get to the terminals in the, in the actual, uh, in here, so right here. You want to get to this right here. This is where you want to get to. 
but I'm not actually connecting them. Uh, all I did was peel it back in order for this to have a connection. And then once I had the connection, I set my lithium ion battery. So I set it to lithium ion battery and I sat there for one minute. How long, Peanut? One minute. One minute. That's how long I took. It was one minute. Once I was done, I disconnected these. And the second I put this sucker on, it started charging instantly. Then I'll, after that, it took maybe two hours to fully charge. So basically what it is is that your battery is fully dead. The charger is not recognizing that it is a battery. So you need to put a small charge onto the battery by utilizing the connections, these connections, These connections, negative, positive, make sure you put it onto the positive, negative, leave it there for a minute or two, uh, and then second you do that, it will definitely, ta-da, it will start charging immediately. So there is no need for you to go out there and buy a brand new battery, which is between $40 and $60. So um, this can actually go with any other trick uh, for other lithium ion batteries. So uh, I would recommend it doing outside, of course. Um, but other than that, that's how we did it. And I saved myself 60 bucks. It took me not even 10 minutes to do it. So... Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you have any questions, please post it in my comments. Thank you. Say bye, Peanut. Bye.